Chicka dee 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 dee. There's the chickadee. Come on, let's eat. Chickadee dee 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 dee. Chickadee dee 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 dee. Chickadee dee dee dee. Oh, there you are. Come on. Come eat. Chickadee dee 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 dee. <laughs> oh, where'd you go? There. Come on. Come on. Chicka dee 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 dee. Come and eat. Oh, you're a pretty cat today. Oh, and here comes a cardinal. morning. Today we're going to an estate sale in Oswego, Illinois, and we're bringing you with. thought I'd give you a little view of our country roads. River is right beyond those trees. Okay, we just arrived at an estate sale. This is the town of Hinkley, Illinois. It's a nice, quiet little town. Looks like a nice house. This estate sale is run by Triple S and they have extremely good prices usually. <laughs> See you inside. Okay. How are, are you? you guys? Uh, we're good. We're good. You're doing numbers tomorrow morning. Yes. Look at that thing. It depends on how you keep it with her. Wow. Yeah, I never saw those. 
I can't believe it doesn't work. I use the pen to help you along. Hmm. This off? Yeah. Bus. 20 bucks. Thank you. Are you guys doing reduced rate tomorrow? Do you wear everything will be half? Perfect. Whatever you like? Yep. Take a chance of doing that stuff, I know. <laughs> Oops, oh, there goes Thank the you. saddle. Yeah, this is speed up, man. I can't believe you never went in. I tried to get in, but you never went in. It's amazing what they have. It's like raccoons in the barn. Raccoons? Who's, who's afraid of raccoons? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you have five dollars. Hey, you. Hey. Good. How are you? Good. Yeah. I'm all right. Hey. I find this good. Okay. Okay. Kitchen. Let's see what's in the kitchen. I'm a sucker for plates. Look at that plate. Isn't that cute? Look at that. Look at that. Pip. Hmm. A little chippy. Oh my gosh. Look at these cute little guys. Hmm. Oh, I've seen see something that I've sold right over here. This is a Swedish piece. Finland. They, they do sell two bucks. Possibility, holy crap, you have to want 48 for this. That is cool. Hmm. never seen before. Here. Let's 
see what's back here. Ooh. Oh, these are not blow molds, they're heavy. Those are weird, aren't they? Huh. No blue molds. Kind of candy canes. Hey, Brian. These are Italy score. Okay, estate sale number two today. Interesting place. Another brick ranch. All right. Let's see what we have here. Oh, it's the second time I've seen one of these. I think they're cool, but two bucks. It's a ball. These are not. No. <laughs> not full tang. Stops right there. Okay. Probably mm -hmm. over. Okay. But good night, you would have. Yeah, no, you don't. Ah, see it's it's everything's How broken. Boy, broken. Glass lids on everything. A shoe shine kit. Yeah, you think so? The prices are pretty high. Yeah, prices. Still high. Jiffy curl, curling iron, I think. Let's see what else they have. Kind of crappy stuff.
Interesting bottles. Holy cow, 10 bucks. Mini picks. What a difference between this estate sale and the other one. She would add two bucks on these. These are 10. So, way too high. Even half price is going to be kind of high tomorrow. 40. These are pretty. Now we're talking 50 for the set. A little high, but these I would definitely take at half price. I think these are really feathers. Very, very cool. I'll have to show Brian. All right, I'll be back. Take a look at that. Don't we have something like that or had something like that? I don't know. Might have. Candlesticks. Hmm. Been selling a few scarves lately. This one is torn. Okay, forget it. Okay. Pictures. Nobody wants a torn scarf. Yes, these. At half price, I'd get these, but they're 50 bucks. 50 bucks? I know. What are they? Pictures. Come back tomorrow. Well, maybe. This, I wonder what they want for this. This is a piano shawl. Is it? I never heard of that. Yep. Wow. I want 20 bucks. That's a piano shawl. That's something else. Oh, that's a well-made piece of no, furniture. No, I don't think so. Okay, I'll be back. So, here's a quick little haul video. Uh, here's the silverware we found. Uh, this is main course and uh, we're splitting this up. Uh, we paid, and here's the other one. Uh, we paid 14 for both sets of silverware. This one is already listed. And this is main course stainless flatware. And we've got all the serving pieces, which are already wrapped up, uh, listed for $84.99. We had some iced tea spoons, which are hard to find, and those were listed for $84.99. Some cocktail forks, and those were listed for $79.99. And we had several five-piece place settings, which were listed for $29.99 each. Okay, <clears throat> and that set is not listed yet, but it is a nice set and kind of unusually big spoons. Brian said these would be great for a tall people, a tall person. He liked the way they felt, and the forks are also rather large. Okay, then we uh, found those knives. These are um, American cutlery, and they are stainless with Bakelite handles. There they are. And there's the name, American cutlery. Here's the fork. Okay, and we paid $8 for those, and they're listed for $106. <clears throat> and then we found these candle holders. One 
one has its snufter there. And the other one does not. <clears throat> They're vintage 70s. They're metal and resin. We paid $4 and we'll be listing for around 30 Okay, then we have <clears throat> this beautiful uh, bowl, which is from Finland, and I don't know if I am pronouncing this right, but there's the tag, if you can see that, and... Nutajarvi, 1793, Finland. We paid $2 for this and listing it for $89.99. I have sold these before. Okay, next we've got a couple of bar items. First, we've got a wood ice bucket, mid-century modern, walnut. There's the inside. <clears throat> we got that for $5, and we'll be listing for $40. Then we got a couple of old wooden bottle openers. Kind of interesting. Got those for three dollars. I'll sell them together for probably around twenty-two. Okay. Next, out in the garage, I found a bunch of hats, and this one in particular, Wrigley Field. Home of the Chicago Cubs opening night. And I would these sell anywhere from fifty to a hundred dollars. This one's a little dirty. But for a buck, you can't go wrong. <clears throat> we also found this beautiful Italian ashtray. It's heavy ceramic, and we paid $3 for that. We'll probably sell it for around 60 Then, the piano scarf. These, these are beautiful, and I've sold these before. <clears throat> and uh, they basically were thrown over the grand pianos as decor. And this one has a little fringe issue. Some are a little knotted together, but I'll try to fix that. But otherwise, it's in pretty good shape. And it's a beautiful color with the peaches and purples and yellows and greens. So that could sell for anywhere from $50 to $100. <clears throat> okay, then I did get the Hunt Pictures. This one's by Arthur J. L.C. from 1908. It's a print. Uh, paid $4 for that and should be about $40 to $50. So cute. And then this one is titled Gone Away, another hunt picture, beautifully framed, $4, should be about $50 to $90. <clears throat> and then I got two that are matching set. I will probably sell these together. Uh, I paid $12 for these. They're by Richard Barrett Davis. They are prints. Uh, Belvar Hounds. 
And then this one is Burton Hunt. So that's a matching set. Pretty nice. And last but not least, I did find a fossil purse at Goodwill. <clears throat> oh, like a messenger bag. Very nice also. Pretty clean, beautiful soft leather. Just gorgeous. And I paid $4.99 at Goodwill. And I don't know, that'd probably be around 30 to 40 bucks. Okay, that's it. And I will see you next week.